Video games have become insanely easy to make, yet most people that want to make one never do. Therefore, I'm making a game in one hour to prove that you can do it. This might be a bit hard. Okay, but first, we need our idea. Since we are only given one hour, I'm going to make the simplest game I could possibly think of, which is Pong. But to make it even simpler, I'm not even going to include the enemy AI. I'm just going to have the ball bounce off the walls. Okay, so the first thing we need is our paddle. So now that we have our paddle, I'm going to add a background and add the invisible walls on the edges of the background. Next, I will quickly add the ball and then we will run the scene and see how it looks. It looks good and that only took 12 minutes to get all the visuals set up for the game. Now we need to start coding. First, we will make it so the paddle can move with player input with the left and right arrow keys. I had to adjust the speed a little bit because I couldn't get it quite right on the first try, but now it looks pretty good. I also made it so it clamps on the left and right so it doesn't move past their boundary. And now it is time to code the ball. First, let's just make the ball move in a random direction when we start the game. Now it looks good, but our ball doesn't collide with any of the walls or the paddle, so we have to add that now. Adding the wall collision wasn't that bad, but now we have to add the paddle collision. This took a bit more tweaking, but now that I have it set up, we are down to our last couple steps to make the game fun. We only have 15 minutes to do it though, so I had to go for a simple solution of just having a point system where you hit these yellow squares to try to get points. I added the yellow squares, now we only have a couple more minutes to get the score counter displayed in the game, so I have to be fast. Okay, now we got it set up with only 5 minutes to spare, so let's quickly play the game and see how we did. Okay, so it's not the most fun game in the world, but it works, and we only made it in 1 hour. So to any of you out there unsure if you could make a game, I promise you, even if it took you 8 hours to make this game, you can make this. However, if you want to make a better game, I do have a video on what Godot tutorials I find to be the most useful than just Pong. So if you like this video, please subscribe and share this video so more people can be inspired to make games.